As Canada's National Museum of Sport, we have a platform and an obligation to amplify black voices and share the lived experiences of black Hall of Famers. Today we bring you the story of ice hockey player and class of 2020-2021 inductee Willie O'Ree. Willie O'Ree is best known for being the first black man to play in the NHL. In 1958, the Boston Bruins had a vacancy due to an injury and they recruited Willie O'Ree from the Quebec Aces to play with their team, breaking the NHL's 41-year color barrier. When asked about his experience in the NHL, Willie said, Being in Boston, you know, back then, they, uh, they were noted for their uh, prejudice, and, but I didn't notice anything. I was very happy to, to be a part of the Bruins. Uh, I was accepted by all the uh, teammates, uh, the coach, Neil Schmidt, general manager, Lynn Patrick. He says, well, you're just another player that we think can help, help win games for us. So I faced a lot of racism and prejudice, especially when I went to New York, Detroit, and Chicago. Not only from fans, you know, in the stands, but players on the opposition. In discussing the only racially driven fight he had, provoked by a Chicago Blackhawks player hitting O'Ree with his stick across the face because he was black, O'Ree spoke to his great character, explaining that despite the amount of racial remarks he heard on the ice, he chose not to be provoked and to instead focus on the game he loved. I never fought because of racial remarks or racial slurs. Uh, I knew that I'd be in the penalty box all the time. Unfortunately, after only 43 games with the Bruins, O'Ree was traded to the Montreal Canadiens, who after 12 games with the team sent him to the Western Hockey League. O'Ree did not get the call to come back to the NHL and finished his career after 11 years in the WHL. Due to the racism Willie faced in his ice hockey career, today he works towards making his sport more inclusive. When asked about his experience being an ambassador for the Hockey is for Everyone program, O'Ree said. The racism that's going on, when you see young 10, 12, 13 year old boys and girls coming off the ice crying because, you know, somebody made a, a racial slur or a racial remark to them, it's just, it just can't be had. You really can. Willie O'Ree is also the NHL's Director of Youth Development, encouraging underrepresented youth to become involved in ice hockey. The NHL has since established the annual Willie O'Ree Community Hero Award in his honor. We can do better. We will do better.